<clears throat> Hi there everyone, I'm some Lego Twink and today I thought I'd make a video um my 1000 um subscriber special so I was like really bigging it up going like oh my gosh I have to have something like so special for like this video like thousand subscribers like that doesn't happen every day but um I just thought like simplest is best so I just thought I'd do a video like a tour of my like entire um Lego collection so um yeah that's what I'm gonna do for you today and as you can see already a substantial amount behind me but seriously you're lucky because you're about to get your socks like knocked off by like how much lego i have and like how much is like over there as well probably this is most of it but still there's a lot more to see so anyways um yeah i'm gonna make a video showing you around my entire collection today so um yeah enough like procrastinating anyway so i'll just okay right so as you can see here, these are my lovely immaculate Lego shelves going from top to bottom. There they are. And um, yeah, as you can see, I've also got some more Lego here and some flags. And um, yeah, that is my Lego ocean liner in the background, as well as some Lego ships over there. And um, yep, that is um, also some Lego in cartons down here. Not to mention all the Lego that I have in drawers as well. So let's get started because, you know, I intend this to be like a thorough, um, pretty thorough review of everything I have. So, um, yeah. Okay. Starting from the very bottom shelf, as you can see, um, poorly lit as it is, although that's probably on purpose. You've got um, some Lord of the Rings sets. So this is from the Hobbit trilogy. You've, of course, got the um, big CGI creature played by Stephen Fry, um, who I love. And, um, yeah, the Hobbit's house and... Um, some castle, moving over here to like proper Lord of the Rings. You got Mines of Moria, you got some medieval knights that I just put there for no reason. You got a bunch of golems just doing whatever. And um, yeah, some orcs with a hand of Sauron, and of course, Helm's Deep. Um, yeah, raised on a special white, um, grey platform there. So, um, yep, yeah, I'm just realizing that I should have put the flash on my phone before starting this, but anyways. Um, yep, yeah, then as you can see, there's the Tumblr, got some Technic sets. And um, yeah, even as you can see in the background, Fire Station and the special Atlantis um, shark headset. So then as you can see here, I've got some German tanks going all the way along. Then you've got um, Police Station, Simpsons House, um, there's a plane, there is a ship. And um, yeah, there is some um, tanks there as well. And um, yep, that is the um, Tower Bridge, as you can see. Got some lovely um, water pieces and that is the Orca. That's a normal fishing boat. Then, um, yep, little model, uh, Lego model of London in the back that I got for uh, Christmas. And, um, yep, got some medieval houses going all the way around. And you've got, oh my gosh, my favourite, like, set ever. It is the Hogwarts set, seriously. Can't find the camera. It is the Hogwarts set, seriously. Like, oh my gosh, seriously. Hogwarts, like. <laughs> anyway. Okay, right, as you can see, that is Hogwarts. And, um, yeah, I got a lovely long train with four carriages going all the way down. Um, based on the Lego um, Hogwarts Express, but this is a dry star set, so um, yeah, it looks just as good to be honest, but um, yep, that is the um, Hogwarts basically. Moving up, you can see you've got a university from Krakow that I visited that they made into a set, that's dry star as well. Got the Parisian restaurant, pet shop, um, some other um, custom modulars, going all the way down to there. You've got like a hotel themed building. Then you've got a florist, you've got the um, FNAF house, I kind of like made the FNAF house because it's like, it's the Joker's Pun house, but um, I don't know, it goes well with FNAF as well. Got another Parisian restaurant, but just because I love the set so much I had to buy two of them and like build them parallel. If you look at them, that building there is parallel to that building there and um, yep, helps the building at the same time, but I built them like not at the same time, so that was difficult. Anyway, um, then you've got the Ghostbusters HQ going up here. Oh my gosh, I'm just psyching myself up so much. I'm getting out of breath. Um, yep, got some more modular buildings. Some, like, German invasion kind of thing happening in there. And, um, yep, Palace Cinema, Fire Station, some more sets. There is a hospital, town hall, some more residential stuff, the Grand Emporium. Then going up to here, as you can see, you've got Doctor Strange's house, which is absolutely um, beautiful from all angles. And then um, the thing with this is... Um, I bought two of them, so as you can see, there's a seam down the middle that you can just, like, barely recognise, and I kind of built them parallel. I did that at the same time, so it was much easier. And, um, yep, then there's Grand Central Station, of course, um, the Avengers Tower. Got, um, the Quinjet, the, um, 
Guardians of the Galaxy jet, I want to say. And um, that is the spire of the Daily Bugle that I can actually fit onto the um, set because it's like literally from where it is on the shelf, like pointing into the attic. Anyways, um, yep, so going down here, got some non-Lego army vehicles. Got the classic creator um, lighthouse, got some coast guard sets, cabins, beach huts. Over there you got the T-Rex, just like, rawr, anyway. <laughs> and then, um, yeah, you got the um, uh, Palpatine's throne room, of course, some more Star Wars um, walkers, uh, droid robot. And um, yeah, then moving along, that is the Daily Bugle. The um, most number of um, characters come with that set, um, little fact. And um, yep, yeah, Mulkin Christmas House. Then, oh my gosh, it's Scooby-Doo. And um, yeah, his amazing monster house as well. So um, there's that. There is also the um, Baron Manor. There's the Monster Castle. And um, yeah, some monster houses. And uh, Arkham Asylum, a big um, non-Lego version of it. Then moving around here, you've got, oh my gosh, my favourite, the Disney Castle. So isn't that amazing? Then you've got the train station, a big fat train with a um, big fat, you know, gear. And uh, yeah, some medieval houses and stuff. So isn't that cool? And um, yep, then you've got um helicopter, some soldiers, airport, Eiffel Tower. Then some mock buildings as well. And... Um, as you can see towards the back, you've got the Minecraft house as well. What? What? <sighs> okay. Um, then there is a castle. Some chess. And, um, yep, the piece de resistance. That is the ship that I have. So, um, going all the way around, as you can see. Just looks abs. Uh right now okay give me a second and then you got some ships there as well and let me just quickly show you there's a palace there as well and then there's that stuff in there and then in the drawers i have things such as characters and i'm being hounded right now so i'm gonna have to cut the video short but um yep yeah, that is that was the video um i hope you enjoyed and that has just been the video i have to open the garage door now so bye